from the Akistats Arena at Caesar Southern Indiana. Welcome to the 2023 Derby City Classic and the 24th edition of the Pocket Billiards All-Around Championship. Thank you, everybody. Thank you very much. The Derby City Classic is proudly sponsored by Diamond Billiard Products, by Simonis Cloth, and by Aramith Belgian Pool Balls, and we thank them so much for being our signature sponsors for so many years, along with our great associates from Outsville and Master Chalk, and the terrific tournament direction team from Bad Boys Billiards Productions. We want to thank once again Caesar Southern Indiana for being such great hosts for well over a decade, and also thank all of you that are watching out there and those of our family that have come here once again ringside. You are the most important part of the Derby City Classic. So thank you very much, and let's play some One Pocket. All right, this is uh, either the end of round eight or the beginning of round nine. You can take your pick on that. 429 players begin. A few less than 24 left. They're still posting up there, and I believe six players have rebuys. With that being said, let's introduce our competitors from Tampa. This gentleman is a former Southern Classic One Pocket and All-Around Champion, former Houston Open One Pocket Champion, and a U.S. Open One Pocket Champion. Sponsored by Pool Dues Bar from Morgan City, Louisiana, it's Hollywood, Justin Hall. Thank you. His opponent and a buddy from Charleston, South Carolina, playing in his second Derby City Classic, a former Super Billiards Expo champion. Please welcome Jason Brown. All right, gentlemen, please lag for the break. We're gonna send it upstairs to the comm box to Mark Wilson and John Schmidt. Take it away. Hello and welcome, pool fans from around the globe. We have world-class pool coming to you next. I'm Mark Wilson, and just to clear up any possible misconceptions, I love pool. <laughs> Joining us today is professional pool player John Schmidt to provide expert insights. Glad you're here, John, and talk a little bit about Justin Hall and Jay Bird. Well, thank you, Jason. Mark, and I'm thrilled to be here. Uh, this is a fantastic match between two of the most talented players I've ever laid eyes on and two of the most likable guys you'll ever want to meet. They are friends, but for this match, they're going to have to be enemies because I tell you what, we're down deep. This is huge. Um, it's a very even match on paper, although some people might not be as familiar with Jason Brown. We call him Jay Bird. Affectionately, he is just a great player, great guy. Uh, I'm a fan of him. And uh, now I'm a little concerned for him in that I don't think he's ever played in this arena, and it is quite a daunting thing. So if he can get over these arena nerves and settle in and play like he's capable of, he could win this match and go on to win the whole tournament. Let's see what happens. Nice opening break. Uh, Hall has won the lag, and that's a pretty big advantage. Not just in the first game, but if it goes down to the last game. He laid it down pretty nice, yeah. and both these guys are going to know all the shots. All the shots. They've both seen 100,000 games in one pocket, and uh, to the folks at home, you will learn something if you watch these two. They really know what they're doing. And they both look to be fast players. Yes. Yeah, they just know what to do so quick. And Jason smartly moves the ball to his side to cover that side of the table. So now Jason, can't, uh, Justin can't bank the one back with inside English freely. He'd like to go up against the pile here off the edge of this 14, I would think, if he can see it. He wants to rifle that bank home, and he can stun across the table mm -hmm. and not give up the 14. That's right. But, but you're going to have to hit it with a velocity that's yes. not going to leave it next to the pocket if that's you miss. Right. This is the one guy I wouldn't want shooting this shot, though. Justin Hall banks phenomenally. I kind of like this shot here. They'll just settle in, get used to the table a little yeah. bit. Try to bump this to your side and go up against the stack. Nice shot. Make your opponent uh, do something. And protect what you have. He's That's got a right. nice layout. He doesn't have to force something here right. unnecessarily. That's Plus right. the one's useful ball where it was. That's right. Jay Bird has to make a real nice hit here to cover the six. Oh, great cue ball control. Boy, that's a good shot because when I'm nervous, I have a hard time going through the cue ball and really putting that draw on it and under hitting it. And he uh, he hit that like he's just practicing. Impressive start by, just, by Jason because uh, he's not played out here on this table, and I'm very interested to see if he can relax and play like he's capable of. Justin wasn't so concerned with making the ball. He wanted to get the cue ball in the right mm -hmm. place and get that 
object ball put over on his side, tried to move balls next to his pocket. Yeah, he's going to try to, I think, kick the two in. Okay, the first really big test this game. I mean, has to make this ball. Oh, he went for the hit on the 15. Wow, that was gutsy. Yeah, that was, that was just tough. No way around it. And it was one of those things that was sort of forced by the ball distribution, That's not right. favoring him. He's going to have to take a little risk there. That's he right. chose to go after the 15 rather than the 2. And I think, you know, this, this table plays a little longer, more slide, and so his kick went a little bit long. You can see the look on his face. He was shocked that it went so long to the side rail. Justin Hall played one match on this table earlier this week, and boy, did he play good. That, if, if anything, it's never as moving, but sometimes his shot making is a little suspect. But that throughout that match, he never missed a ball he was supposed to make. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's super tough. He's a 2021 U.S. Open one pocket champion. I know he won a big event. I believe it was in Tunica as well. Well, I'll tell you what a guy like... Justin does so well that I've always been impressed with all the pros because they all seem so good at this is he's able to play under duress like he's practicing and that's a real art to be able to do that that's not easy to do um, I've been playing for a long time and I still feel like I'm trying to figure that out how to relax under the gun and, and Justin just he looks so calm out there because I think he is <laughs> yeah I you know too. yeah And a dream start for him. If he can win this first rack, puts a lot of pressure on Jaybird, who, like I said, you know, has not been out there in this position. And this isn't like a second round match, Mark. You know, where you're just kind of playing for pride. Like this is down deep where you can win this thing. There was four hundred and twenty nine players to begin. There's twenty two. Yeah, exactly. Speak. I mean this is like the real deal here. Nice speed. Well, a lot of times when I'm in a tournament, like first round or sitting here on the TV table, you know, you just want to look pretty. You don't want your like ex-wife watching it on YouTube and you losing. <laughs> so, so you're just playing for like pride and ego. But now, this is like you know, yeah, you're right there to win this whole thing. If Justin can make this shot, mm -hmm. looks like he's trying to draw it back. But I think he should go ahead and go into the <laughs> one and just play a two cushion <laughs> bank on the one. Well, oh no, it laid good. I agree with you there. Like get on seven. He, oh, I think he needs one. Yeah, he yeah. needs one. And because the balls are still in play, Bird's going to let him shoot it. <laughs> Just as laughing. Did you want to concede this? Hmm. And he has to elevate a little bit here to, to not scratch on the side. Oh, nice shot. Uh, he's in dead pond. You see what I mean? He's just playing shot. this. Yeah. Is maybe some of the finest pool I've seen Justin play I, in his first two matches here. Well, in my opinion, these are two of the best one-pocket players in the world, and um, it's an honor to get a chance to do the commentary. I'm having fun watching these guys play. It's going to be a high-powered match, though. The table's playing so good that it's going to allow these players to show what they really can do. The table's playing perfect. Dry, just fantastic conditions. Got to watch that 10 ball sneaking out. That's what happened. No, he went to the Mac. second oh, ball. Oh, boy, that 10 snuck out on him. No, that's. He went to the second he ball. He sure break, did, though. didn't he? Yeah. Well, luckily for Jay Bird, I don't know if Justin can get back around on the balls here. He might be able to get one. But see, Justin is such a smart player. He might not even shoot this, Mark. He might shoot the come off the 14 and get behind the four. I wouldn't be surprised if he turns down this 10. Nah, he's going to try to make it. In. Well, he doesn't want Justin just oh. kicking it in. Yeah. So it doesn't solve a whole lot. Oh, he, oh, was, he was able, able to, to. Oh, what a shot. Nice shot. Now, what I like here is I go into the 6-2 off the 7, and the cue ball will mm. glance over for the 14 sometimes. Right. I mean, I think it's worth the risk. And at the very least, maybe you can kick the four away yes. a little bit yes. or something like that. Yeah. Okay, well, a little bit, a little bit bad. Okay, yeah. not hideously bad, no. but just not quite ideal. Now, do you think he banks the fourteen with inside English? Tries to make the four, rail first, and bank the four, 
14? I, I, I think he might bank the 14. I don't think he's going to try to make the four because it's up from the rail. I think he'll just leave the four there and just go up for the two. Okay. Or just take the four out. Uh -huh. One of those two things. I kind of like taking the four out. I mean, these balls, these balls are just, no, I just knocked the four away. Oh, these guys go for blood they sometimes, do, don't too. They? Yeah, yeah, they play aggressive. Oh, wow, he's going for this bank and but knocking he, the four. I hope he's not stiffing it. I hope he's oh. going in front of it. Yeah, like this. What a shot. Oh, he no, did try to make the four. He made it, though. Well, in his mind, he's like, listen, I bank great, so I'm probably going to make the bank, and if I don't, I'll probably make the four. Kind but of that's, two. that is why I don't like going for the four off that ball because you just move it closer, when you and if you hang up that bank, now he's up at the yeah. where if he – clears it but maybe he could I, so. I think he went all in to make the four though yeah I, I, you know he's yeah. just such a great banker too on any event nice shot there and look at that now he's you know that was subtly difficult i mean he was elevated there and, and the, the viewers at home um you yeah. know when you're elevated you can miss anything i would say it like this for every degree that you raise the cue you lose two percent of your accuracy until you reach 10 degrees at which point you start losing three percent of your accuracy per degree yeah, that sounds about right to me but once you get to 20 degrees even the pros are missing yeah so boy this is just look at let's see his ball speed see yes. how he's laying it in there yes, good make the good decisions kind of a bummer for jason because <clears throat> We're not really getting to see what he's capable of yet, but trust me, he's not out of this match. I've seen him play for years, and uh, he's as tough as they get. He might play this yeah, and play the bigger yeah, too, and right? Before, and yes. then just get on the combination, just to, well, or no? Yeah, I like that. You know, you can obviously scratch through the four. For me here, I I much rather just play the eight. And just yeah. get that ball down. Okay. And then come across for the combination and try to bury the four yeah, simultaneously. Okay. And just get on seven no matter what we do. Oh, yeah. That was okay. a nice shot. Hmm. No. Might, yeah. Yeah, you, it's not so good now anymore. Now you might come it? off the 12 and make the four. Oh, he's going for the combo. Wow. If he misses this combo, now he could lose this game. But maybe he can get the four here, too. But you can also you scratch can behind scratch, the four. Right. Yeah, that's the other part. Oh, he hit that great. Oh, well, that, look, at he just went all out. He yeah. didn't even bother with yeah. the four, which made the Eight combination play yeah. better. Eight and out. You, this is, you're seeing the best of Hollywood yeah. Hall. I mean, right this here. match here is uh, – Let's get another look at Jason's break here. We can see if he does go just purely second ball. I've seen this happen a couple times this week where guys intentionally mm -hmm. go. You know, we normally oh, split he them. Did. He did. Well, or the deflection tricked him yeah, a little Yeah, one bit. or the other. Yeah, probably the deflection. I'll tell you why. He, usually you don't see him go in there with that type of speed, and they go a little bit lower on that second ball when they're hitting the well, second this, ball. This match could be over quicker than my first marriage right here. This Ooh. is not uh, This is not what Jaybird <laughs> was looking for. That was a quick one. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's too bad because uh, we know that uh, Jason can definitely make a better accounting for himself, but that's at these short matches, well, and you just played like one like this with Pat Yeah, and, and when you play these high power world champions, I mean, it, it just can go like this. Right. I mean, these guys uh, are great players, and they're going to assassinate you in one inning sometimes. But well, uh, I just hope the fans at home get a chance to see Jaybird play because, tr believe me, he is triple world class at one pocket. Love his game. And you can see how Hollywood. When uh, Hollywood, uh, you can see how aggressive he was oh, on those yeah. banks. I mean, he's when he sees a chance, he's going. Yeah. Yeah, Justin's Justin's a great banker, as good as anybody. Mm. And really, one pocket is a first cousin of banks. I mean, you you have to be a good banker to play a good one pocket. There's no way around it. You can talk about running balls all you want, but mm -hmm. you're going to have a shot, including a rail, a lot. Ton of knowledge in one pocket mm -hmm. comes into play. It's not just execution. No. Just taking an intentional foul, trying to preserve the edge that he has here with the ball distribution. Yeah. Well, what's cool about this, I mean, Jaybird's down 2-0 and up against the balls, and I wouldn't be surprised at all if he wins the whole match. That's the kind of player this guy is. If he can settle in and make this bank and go three rails, look at here. Get down there near the hole. Well, 
Nice idea. Nice, yeah, nice execution with the cue ball. <clears throat> and Justin's got a free bank on the 10-11 combination. Or twist the one back. The, ten, the problem with shooting the 10 is you disturb the balls, but the 7 is fairly dead to Jaybird's hole, so I think Justin wants to just move that a smidge. I think you can go inside spin and avoid the... Yeah. Oh. See, that fixed his problem, because that was wired almost down. Now it's uh, it's starting to get ugly now. Uglier than your that, first marriage. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ugly. <Yes. Yeah. laughs> Uglier than Maxine Waters. This is not looking good. <laughs> oh, what a shot. Ooh, very heady. Yes. Take a ball off the side well, and make Justin. And, ball. you know, and I think most good players know that that's what you have to do, but he was able to do it when he had to have it. All right, well, that changed the complexion of the distribution of the balls here. Just going to try to twist this bank back and double them up on the seven, I guess. Good, good speed. Yeah, good, good speed. <laughs> sure was. Man, Justin, or Jaber does not have much here. He has to do something with the 14, I believe, and try to go back up into the 11. Now, see the problem with this? Now, when you shoot this bank, your cue ball is going to hit the nine and snuggle right up against the balls. This is death. This is death right here. Not trying to make it, mm -hmm. just trying to put mm -hmm. it over there, but ensure that That's that cue right. ball is pinned in That's there. Right. Maybe graze off the six and go three rails around behind the three, underneath the three. Okay. Live to fight another day. Couldn't do much there. Might just lightly kick, take a foul, and just go back into the side of the stack here. You don't even need to rub the 11 ball and risk it. Right. And I think he's coming off the 11 and back on the pile, but this can go bad real quick. Oh, he hit it nice. <laughs> JL. Made that, made that Pinned it. Easy. Pinned it. Oh, and this is going to be hard. <laughs> yeah, he's Get gonna, back there. You that's know. right. Come off the six, jacked up like this. Oh, my goodness. Almost rather two rail kick at the three ball, but he hit it great. what, he hit that great. Now, Justin's not looking at the one. Maybe it doesn't go very easily. He wants to get him back on the stack. So That's not, right. He recognizes if he can defend um, that three, it really keeps Jaybird hung up. Uh-oh. Oh, Big Jason's trouble. got his first chance. Now, this is difficult, but this is difficult. This looks like he's got a great shot here to get started. He doesn't. He's going to do well to even make this ball and get a bank or... No, well, if he gets Maybe, up on the seven, yeah, here, then he. But you know, like I, doing this when you're practicing is one thing. Can you do it right now under the lights when it counts? So much heat on him. Just take the if, bank. It, yeah. Okay. Now he's a heck Ooh. of a banker. If he scores this bank, it's probably over for this game. Nice shot. Well, hmm. That yeah. cue ball's running into the balls the wrong way. But I thought he was getting on the two there. Whew, man, I'd be tempted to cut the two instead. Oh, he's going to try to draw off the two. Hopefully the two goes off the eight a little bit like that. Oh, you got to make that one. Yeah, I was pulling for him there. Make a match of it. I think uh, Justin straight in. I don't Dead know. Ball. He may have to throw it a little bit. But, yeah, if, if he can make mm. the five. Cadaver. <laughs> He's got a cadaver. <laughs> I don't know if he has a cadaver. Maybe not. Boy, it no. looks wired, doesn't it? No, it looks a little bit high. And if he goes this way, uh, oh, but I could be wrong. Cut away from we're, it. Wow. we're 25 feet away, so it's not yeah. that easy. Well, if Justin can't make this, then uh, we got a ball game. But I, If you I need to throw it, this is the way to shoot it on this side, yeah. that's for sure. He may need the bridge. But Hollywood don't like the bridge. The only other shot I'd like would be to shoot the two into the rail and catch the four coming out, and they both kind of jam out of there. But this is going to go right in. I mean, jeez. Boy, nothing's going right for Jason. And, you know, you have to make that cut. He'll be the first to admit he just had to make that cut. 
We're, where Hollywood plays, you get to get up on the table. And that's really? Where he's comfortable. <laughs> well, you oh, know wow. how they are oh, in Louisiana. Yeah. Right? Oh, so yeah. It's wide open. It's all on the table. <laughs> <laughs> Guys got pet gators and stuff. <laughs> 44 mag on their <laughs> yeah. side. Yeah, I wanted the I wanted the people at home to get to see Jason move and play a little bit because man, is he a great mover! But uh, it doesn't look like we're going to get to see much of him today. This has been a Justin Hall show, and you can see how he's playing. Oh, he's, he's just playing takes great. one little crack oh, of an opening, or he can make an opening. Yeah, yeah. I don't call him world class just to be nice. <laughs> he is really a great player. Yeah, if you're a top one pocket player, the best you can be is even. With yeah, Justin Hall, and yeah. you're, or you're an underdog. underdog yeah, you're never a favorite. Nope. Ooh, hit that little rough, yeah, Jay Hall, and kind of popped up out of there. Well, this is really, really the last chance Jay Burr has to do much. Um, mm. I've seen people win matches from here, down two nothing and ball seven to like zero, seven to two, and and could maybe come back. What's the score? Five two. Well, not really out of it. Five to two, especially if this lays up for any no kind good. of decent. Yeah, bank. that was a little lackadaisical on his part. It really it, was. Yeah, two two mistakes too because the position shot you would never mm -hmm. come up short on the two. Mm -hmm. that you if they're air you want to be on the strong side. If you come up short, that's the only way you can really now, get in trouble. Now, do you like trying to just catch the one coming off the rail here? No, or do you don't. You don't even think about that. Uh, oh, how do you hit it though? My God, that was a good shot. Tons of English. Well, we got a ball game here. All right. If he can punch a couple shots in. He doesn't have much angle here to get position. Good shot. Boy, that was a nice stroke. Great shot there. Now come across come for the across. one. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you got to make that, Jason. Ah, see, he... I'm telling you, folks, this, this playing in this arena on camera in front of big crowds is a learned thing. You, you, it just, it's just hard to play good. And Jay, in fairness to Jason, he's more of a money player. He doesn't play a ton of tournaments. He definitely has not been in this AccuStats arena before. So um, he's just not quite comfortable. I don't blame him. Oh, man, he needed that ball to not go in. And look at that. Hmm. Now, have you played Jason before? Um, I don't think I've ever played him. No, I've never played him in a tournament. And I don't think we've ever played for money, but I've known him 20 years. It feels like I played him 100 times just because I've seen him so much, but... And you know a lot of the people he hangs out with, oh, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, Justin Hall was my teammate in uh, London for the Moscone Cup in 14, and we were roommates. So, I mean, uh, you know, Justin, uh, one of my buddies uh, in pool, I've always been a big fan of his. He's a class act and obviously a super talented player, but um, has always treated me real well. In a bit of irony, his brother is the mayor of a little town right next to the little tiny town that I live in. Oh, really? Yeah, Preston. And he's a good player, too, in no his own kidding. right. And then, yeah. I mean, it's just he's kind the of mayor. A, I'll be dang. He is, yeah. All right, so the count 6-5, Jason. Uh, the balls favor Justin, kind of all on his side. Hello, Z Bank. Yeah, Justin. Huh? Yeah, a Z Bank or even a. Um, well, I don't cut. think he'll cut it. If you cut it, you might knock those balls. Right. Out. Yeah, I think you double bank it. The double mm -hmm. bank opens up so much, so he'd have to almost just miss the side. Yeah, it's pretty wide right. here, so yeah. he may have to pinch it. And oh, he's cutting it. He doesn't figure to make anything. 
off this cut. Okay. Well, that was the problem with that, and he knew it. Ooh. Well, he gave up this a little bit of a good. bank, yeah. Yeah, that's not good at all. Shaver's as good as anybody at these. Got to make this, though. This is uh, routine for fun. At least get it dripping in the pot. Yes, get it hanging. Look at this dead center. Tried to hook him on that ball. Mm -hmm. Well, Jason needs one. Don't let him get comfortable. Win a couple games. Justin knows full well how dangerous Jaybird is, and uh, if he can escape this this game here and win this game, it's on. There you Look go. At that Look shot. At that there. shot. Nice. Put it on layaway. <laughs> not quite that buried. Yeah, not that buried, but that's a good shot. Yeah, he needs one. Oh, nice bump there to mm -hmm. keep the cue ball a long ways from the 14. Can he bank this 14? I, oh, think, I he think he can. He can too. I think he can twist it with some left to get it to lengthen out a little bit. Just like that. Oh boy, got the kiss. Boy, that table's quick. Look at that thing. Hey, what a nice hit, too. Yes, it was. Create that angle. A lot of times here, I kind of like kicking behind this ball and getting it out and to the right. But, well, yeah, I guess he can dig down and draw it out of there. Let's see what he does. Oh, he went for the double bank. Wow. Yeah, he needs it to jump up a little bit. Now, Justin knows if he doesn't make this, he gives up a bank on the 13. Most likely, the cue ball will kind of come around the 13. Oh, he just hit it beautifully. Man, these guys bank good, don't they? Hmm. Yeah, pocket the 14, just stay down there. Whoa, what is he doing here? Is he trying to knock this out of there? Oh, my God, Jason. Well, I'll tell you what. That's not the worst thing that could happen. Look at this. They both spot up. <laughs> they both kind of smile at each other. I. Uh, he should have conceded that. Well, ball. you know, he saw something I didn't there. I guess he thought that could come out, but that, that was, uh, as Grady used to say, fraught with peril, and it was. You can't turn the key. You're I on mean, the hill. You, you need one. Yeah. It, you need just one. Just concede that yeah. ball. Don't even try to. Yeah. It'd be different if it was 6'6 six, six or 7'7. Seven, yeah, I kind of liked him just giving. Justin, that Here's ball. a replay. Um, oh, he went for the double kiss out. Look, he tried to hit ball first on the left side. No, he did go rail first. Well, that was um, kind of optimistic right there. It's What's up? We're on a player break? <laughs> a player break. <laughs> All right. Well, we're, we're here. We'll be back in just a moment. Mm -hmm. Look at Jay all down there laughing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Drinking water, too. Well, he's in a good spot. I mean, he's like round nine in the one pocket, up two games to zero. Like, if you're not enjoying this as a player, like, uh, yeah. pool's not for you. No, he has fun. Oh, yeah. All right, everybody, we're back. And Justin's asking that the cue ball does have ball in hand. Yeah, he's going to do the old. Uh... Oh, he's playing safe. Oh, he's not driving through him and trying to make the one. Okay. A lot of guys don't. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you can kind of play that either way. This is where I learned something when I watch these great movers because from this position, one false move. You see he just covered every lane. Ah, that was crafty right there. He might have left a two-railer. Yeah, he might have left a two-railer. No, he didn't either. That was a good shot. Subtle, but very effective. Mm-hmm. Justin, good job. Just move the mm -hmm. ball on his side. Same thing here. Get this ball to your side. 
Okay. Well, I think Justin might try to twist back yeah, to 13. Yeah. You know, I, I've seen players shoot it and let the cue ball go two rails at the 14 and kind of knock it towards their side. That might be a little uh, extravagant for my taste, but it's it's laying right. And in this case, boy, the thirteen's up a little high for that. Okay, I, I think. Yeah, he's going to just draw to the rail. If it was out. down a little bit lower, it wouldn't be so bad. Nice shot, just dead center. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, it is spooky how good they bank in it. I think he's going to one rail six, this six. fourteen yep. right to his pocket. Yep. Got to hit this with just like a high ball, right, Mark? No left or right English. Maybe even a fraction of left. If you, if you, well, if you use right, it's because you're trying to get behind the one simultaneously. You see what I'm saying? Just a hint. Yeah, of I, I need to put the brakes on that cue ball. I think I'd hit that with a fraction of low inside and let the cue ball well, just check. You And you play a lot more one pocket well, than I do. So. let's see. Uh, yeah, I think he's putting the brakes on the cue ball just a little bit. Nice shot. How's his yeah, speed? He, he did get good. the cue ball across the table. Now he needs that ball to stop right there. Now I'll tell you what. If Jason needed them all and Justin needed one, he would bank the one and draw the cue ball three rails around behind the 14. But I don't think he'll do it here. He's just going to pocket speed this down. Just get it in play. Nice shot. Oh, there's a cool shot here. It's not like you can kick two rails off the back of the one and make the 14, especially if the 14 was a half inch closer to the rail. Mm hmm. But it's not quite laying right. And you have to high velocity. Well, that shot. well yeah. hard, you know, the one leaves town, though. That's what I like about that shot. The one will leave. And you can make the ball, but no need. Well, that was a good shot. A lot can go wrong with that one. Is he going for the bank here? Bank with shape on the one. Uh, look at this cue ball. Get up behind the one. Almost perfect. Well, this is not an easy shot. No, no, because around, it, you, know, you can scratch you, well, on this easy. You can sell out the one, too. Or you could just hit it perfect. Like, Golly. Like just, uh, just what a nice shot. Nice shot. What a shot. Man, what do you do here, Mark? <laughs> I think I might have to. Well, if you give it to him, you got to shoot the one and try to make the 14 at the same time. I don't see any other option. And I don't think you can make the 14, really. You better make the one. Oh, my God, what a shot under the circumstances. <laughs> what a shot. He's going to try to point hook him here. Roll forward and not let him see the 12. Great courage. He did it. What a shot. He earned himself a what lot a right there making right. that one. If he somehow wins this match, you remember that one he just punched in. That was Two of quite them. courageous. Yeah, he's just getting point hooked, too. It's, that's not the easiest no, thing to do. Oh, that was incredible. Now, Justin's got to take a soft kick at this. Boy. Take a soft kick. He'd be thrilled to hit this ball. Well, here's yeah. the thing. If you foul, you let him have a look. Right. So maybe you just take a foul and not even – you hate oh. to do it. You hate to do it, but if you say yeah. you soft kick it and don't get, uh, don't get a legal shot. And you can scratch in the corner pocket doing it too. Yeah. So. Yeah, I think he's uh. He's gonna kick twice and taking a foul. No, he went after it. Oh, he hit it. Oh, he scratched. He scratched. I think. No, he didn't. But he did leave us, like you said. Man, did Jay Bird turn this game around? Impressive. Hasn't won it yet. Now, do you like trying to hit this firm? I do. You do, and just figure yeah. if you miss it, it overcuts and leaves. He's down a ball. Yeah, he, I mean, you know he needs to. I don't like rolling. It. Yeah, it's rolling on the bank yeah, every time. Yeah, it seems like. Yeah, I like that. Wow, speed. what a shot! Man. What a shot! He just basically a yeah stands up player here. Well, I mean, just like hitting a one iron right on the green from two sixty. That I mean, in case anybody thinks that was an easy shot. Mm. A little sloppy from Hollywood a there. A little bit. Yeah, I, I really think he should have taken a foul for this the same exact circumstance that I described. Well, I mean, look at the two shots that Jaber just punched in there yeah. in a row. Unbelievable. Yeah. Absolutely. Unbelievable shot making under pressure. I'm super impressed, especially down 2 nothing. Wow. Now, if he can get off a good break here. Don't sell out the corner ball there. He held the corner ball good. Well, he hit the head ball that yeah. time, too. Yeah, that helps, huh? 
I believe Justin will drive through the 12, knock it to his side, go up behind the 5. A little bit of right English makes this a little tricky. Nice touch. Now take a foul into the stack, I would think. You've got to defend the 5. Tyler Steyer and I were talking about it. He was saying, he goes, what's kind of your thinking when the ball, when you, you know, have ball? I said, it's like building a sandcastle for three hours and you don't want some bully to just kick it over and move all, you have to defend and really yeah. protect it. So once you get the balls over near your hole, take the fouls, do whatever you need to do to not let them knock them away from your mm -hmm. pocket. Well, he's looking at something aggressive here. I think he's going to take a slow kick up into the 11-13. Oh, he's going for the bank, Mark. Look at this. Wow. And let, oh, what a shot. Cute five into the stack. Now that was crafty there. Nice shot. A little unlucky that Justin can knock the five into the seven and just clear out all his little sandcastle, basically. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I like the shoddy shot there, though. Mm -hmm. That can really work sometimes. Now he's got to go into bunt mode. You just got to come off the 10 lightly over to this side. Looking at about 40 years of experience playing one pocket between the two of them, if not more, and 100,000 games of one, of one pocket experience. Two master technicians at the game. Come off the five up against the stack, I would think. Nice shot. Well, for sure, in Justin Hall's case, he makes a living playing one oh, pocket yeah. for the last oh, yeah. decade. So. Oh, yeah. It's not like he kind of likes it or something. No, look at this shot. I mean, how smart is this? Just knew immediately that was the right play. Just take a foul? Yeah, I mean, that's when you know you're playing somebody who really can play when they just, they just instantly know what the right shot is from experience. They've done it so much, they don't have to ponder and think. Another three inches. Mm -hmm. I'll thin off the eight here and go up into the pile. Beauty. Now he's going to come off the three and try. Boy, see, if you try to hit this with enough pace, he'd like to get yeah. the cue ball right up into the nine, but he, he would have to put too much pace on us. I think he'll just get to the end rail. Oh, he did. He took the foul into it. Oh, God, don't go through there. Oh, man. Yeah, can't do that. Not pulling against Justin, but I just, I really wanted to see Jason get settled. High right cue ball on this. Try to come around for shape on something. Hey, turned it just a fraction too much. Might make it. Okay. Well, I don't, I don't know if the three passes. I don't think he has much here. Can he bank the one? Um, three back? Or? If he could bank the one and draw the cue ball into the 12, I think that's what he'd do. But he might just knock the 1-5 to his side. He can kind of do that and get into the pile. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, I'll tell you what. Now, I'd be looking to see if that three's dead, Jaybird. 
Take a peek at the three, even though he'll probably shoot the two and then bank the one. Hey, he's looking at the three. Man, that looks Boy, wired. That, man, that's close that, enough. But there's a lot of collisions going on there, but, man, I'd have to look at it. Yeah, if that three goes. Well, I mean, for, just make the two and then the one and then shoot it. The longer the match goes, too, the stronger Jason's oh, going to get. Oh, yeah. He's going to get over those, those nerves and, and get comfortable. I mean, Justin Hall's not safe yet. Oh, he's really not safe now. Clearly, he thinks the three oh, goes. I think so. If that's the case, he could just it, rip them all well, open. Well, or he'll bun it soft and lay it up by his hole, but I think he's going here. No, he wasn't sure. Oh, it wasn't, it wasn't dead, so he just did that. Okay. Well, Justin's going to try to kick the three in. Not the easiest task. Oh, he might even be covered. Look at this. There's a game changer. Now Justin might have to just shoot the 15 away and stay in the pile for a minute. Wow. That won't be any fun. No, that's no fun at all, but I don't see any other option. If I'm Justin, I'm going to try to shoot the 15 and stay right there. As a point, you when you spot balls, the one ball that you're spotting cannot freeze to the cue ball. Right. If it's an object ball, then you freeze it. But if yeah. it's a cue ball, there has to be a gap. I don't know what constitutes a gap, though. That's mm -hmm. the one bad thing about the rules right. is that it's vague. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. 16, 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. How much is that? I think he's got to shoot the 15 away and stay there. Or the 6. Yeah, if you can move the 6 to your side, that'd be nice. Good shot. <coughs> well, what, what Jason's looking at, he, he wants to make sure he doesn't let him have any kind of kick oh god well that got away from him could have been worse yeah it could have been worse but i think justin can make the three it's gonna mass a a little mm -hmm. bit to get there though nice shot good shot yeah, you know, conceding one ball there, that was mm -hmm. tremendous. To get away only giving up one, right. was thrilled. Well, what a team effort we have here putting on this event, right, Mark? With Pat Fleming and his crew, Mike Howard and AZ Billiard, Zach Goldsmith with Digital Pool, um, you and Jeremy, the best voices in pool, working 10 hours a day for a week. It's... Uh, not to mention Mike on the boom camera. Yes, and all the Mike and, and the that's, I mean, Joel. It's, it's the people at home. Uh, I think really people. appreciate it. Yeah, really nine appreciate people. the effort. It is quite a production putting on this uh, this great footage for the viewers at home. We got the easy part. We yeah. got the glory part, but they right. get the hard part. That's right. It's long, tedious days. That's of right. To bring good coverage. And Upstate Al's back there too. Let's not forget him. He's a character, isn't he? He's oh, a yeah. good dude. Good dude. Ken Schumann, working every day, all day. What's Justin looking at that yeah, combo? I don't know what he's looking at. I mean, surely he wouldn't shoot that. you got to drive through the six and put it on your side. I, I cannot. Okay. See, this is where I, I get confused. I think I understand how to play pool, and then a world-class player does this and completely blows my mind. I just cannot picture shooting this. I mean, although I can kind of see where he's going with it, but I don't know. Yeah, he was actually, to you know, all that down yeah, there. it's not as bad looking as, because he was figuring to guard him with the seven. That actually is not a bad shot. More look at it, you know, and you don't figure mm -hmm. anybody to punch the eight in from there. So yeah, smart shot. I just was, I didn't see it. Justin just feels like if he can lay this mm -hmm. on the rail and you punch that in there, more good shoot. Yes. I wasn't going to beat you anyway. Yeah, sign my case. Nice shot. You know. Sign my case. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I right. like it. Now, do you try to go through the eight and bank the ten next? 
or do you? I do, yeah. I mean, you know, the score being two balls to one, I, I wouldn't be against just knocking the 10 away if I can get to it. I don't know that he can get past the seven to do that, though. Wow, he's shooting. Wow. Well, look at all the hard shots he's already made. And, well, uh, he, he's clearly playing good. Well, no, he's changed the change of mind. Oh, he's shooting a seven into the 10. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, that's a smart shot there. Nice shot. Yeah, I don't Boy, think he don't know the game. He look did at, a lot of good well, things Well, look at that. He moved 30 balls to his hole, and Justin's froze on the back row. Great shot. Great yeah. shot. Took all the threats That's that Justin right. had right off the table. Yes, very nice. And then he you know, forced him to play a docile, mm -hmm. passive return. Absolutely. Escape yep. the wrath. Well, the balls really favor Jason here. 100%. And he's earned that. That's no accident. Good cue ball. Oh, yeah, Justin Hall's in for a fight now. I would make Jason a pretty good favorite this rack from here. See how it turns out, but he's a favorite. Nice hit. Oh, might have wired up the 14. For Jason. Close. That's good. Yeah. Casey Gander at it. Might be able to hit this 13 um, and just kind of get it down about where the cue ball is and the, and the cue ball over to the right where he can't see it. Mm -hmm. Got a nice chance to get something started here. Yeah, you said get the 13 yeah. where the cue ball's yeah. at now? Yeah. Oh, that'd be Yeah, they just get huge. it through that lane between the 6 9. That would be huge. And if the cue ball settled in over here yes. on this other side of the table, that'd be perfect. Hit it pretty good. Oh, yeah, he hit great it pretty shot. Good. Oh, oh, off the He seven. won that nick. Look uh -huh. at that. Great effort. Well, Justin, it looks like you're playing on a cruise ship. You need to do something here. He is in big trouble to win this game. They all favor Jason. I really think the only shot is to come off the top of the one, over to the side rail, drip to the end rail. Hopefully the two comes up far enough. Mm -hmm. I don't see much else. You see anything here? Everything what else tough. could you do? Maybe drive through the 15, but... Yeah, because he'd like to undeaden that 14, I think. He'd like to... Yeah, he'd like to move that 14. He might shoot the 15 up into those balls and follow forward. Hmm. Justin's a good shot. Yes. That's a courageous shot yes. there. Yeah, Justin isn't, isn't going to overlook anything. He's... Uh, he knows the strength of that dead ball for Jason. If anybody could wiggle out of this, though, it's Hollywood Hall, but I, <laughs> he's in big trouble. I kind of thought he could come off the top of the one, but, you know, it's the player has so much of a better angle to see that stuff, I'm guessing. He's shooting a 15, I think. Oh, he can see. Uh-oh. Oh, wow. What a shot. Do you think he meant to hit that ball? I do. Because if he's that good, that's just scary. Man, you couldn't put a gun on me to run into that 13. But what else have you got? Right. I, I think mean, that's where geez. his back was against the wall. He was going to have to make a good hit Man. and then make a second good hit <sighs> all in one shot. Now just brush the one over to your side. Cue ball and then rail. Didn't get a whole lot of energy on that one, but maybe he didn't want to. That that was really an outrageously good shot to to go into that thirteen like he did and not sell out. You're saying uh, Justin? I, Paul's I would love right, to know yeah. th to know if that's what he meant to do because I would never run into that ball unless I had to. See, he knows the strength of this dead ball. Look at him moving it. You think he doesn't know how to play one pocket? Look, Look at, at the this. Speed. Look at this. Nibble it to Whoa. his hole. Oh, okay, yeah. Wow. You're great dealing. shot. This is a train killer right here. <laughs> wow. Very smart. And the speed and mm -hmm. settle the cue ball in, get a ball over your That's side. Right. Man, he did a lot with that shot. That's right. Those last two shots, both of them, oh, that one and the one before it. Well, that one there, I mean, that was just uh, the right shot. And it's what the top players are going to do. They always pick the right shot, it seems. I like him coming off this 10 and down to the end rail. The problem is a lot of times the 6 will leave, and you're going to leave him the 10 towards his hole. And the ten's not that bad of a no, combo from no. down table either. So. No, he has to move it. Don't scratch off this. Very easy to scratch. Good shot. Well, hmm. Well, 
do you like just bumping the 10 to your side and trying to stay behind the 6? That wouldn't be terrible. Oh, no. Hard to do. Right. But I think that's the shot. Hit it with kind of a, oh, no, he's digging the cue ball, isn't he? Oh, Put what a little he's doing? I think he, Banking oh, the 6. Wow. Oh, look six. at his cue ball. What a nice cue ball. Great <laughs> oh, shot. Golly. Great shot. Jay Hall. Oh. Yeah, reverse the game. Wow. Three shots in a row yeah. now. Bert. Spectacular oh. one-pocket shots. Now Bird has to come off the one underneath the 14 and lay right over there near the six. This, uh, when you're elevated a little, you can mess this up easy. Mm-hmm. The ball still favored Jason a little bit, but he has to make a great shot right here to uh, get out of this mess. What in the world is he doing? I can't tell. Oh, he, he's one of those guys that cues like center, center, and then puts the spin. That confused me. Nice shot. He'd like to got behind the 14, obviously, but nothing wrong with this. I think, I think Justin will actually do something maybe with the 10. I mean, what can you do with this? He's kicking at this. Holy cow, look at this. He's kicking. Oh, boy. Oh, had some value in yeah, that one. Yeah, it did. Didn't sell out no, the cross corner bank. No. He did good with that because it was iffy. Oh, he's looking at banking the six into the back edge of the 14 and trying to stay behind the 13. Ugh. Nice idea. Well, <laughs> yeah. So it's communism. I mean, this is, look at this shot. Oh, he hit, he hit it good. He did it. He did it. He almost did what I was saying. He almost stayed right behind it. World class yes. one pocket, yes. sir. <laughs> yep. He knows all the shots. Real first. Yep. yep. Dig it out of there. Now we're getting to see the moving. This is what yeah. I was hoping the fans at home got to see. Two great movers. We, we've just seen a, a series of shots here yes. that are just stunning. And, and if you don't know these shots when you're playing them, you will get Mutilated. Yeah. If you don't Mutilated. know all these things that they're doing, yeah. you can't beat them. Yeah, you know, lifetime of experience and knowledge, and, and they both have super high pool IQs anyway. Mm -hmm. But their one pocket experience is just—they uh, just know every shot known to man. I get a kick out of watching it. Now this is dangerous. He's going for the bank. He's going all out. Look at this. Oh. Oh, no, he didn't either. And I don't think he was trying to combo it into that ball. That's dangerous, and it only gets you one. Mm -hmm. He was playing a safe there. Don't you think? Yeah. I don't think he was trying to hit it, no. He was trying to get the cue ball down here, and mm -hmm. the ball was going to have that speed with that oh, type of hit. Nice Another great hit. Yep. It's real easy to just draw that right in the subway, or as my wife likes to say, sewer. Went right in the sewer. <laughs> Well, Justin's starting to move the balls around now to where it's about uh, the balls don't really favor either player. They favor Justin slightly because of this ball near his hole. Kind of hard to take that yeah, that's right. out of there yeah, right that's now. That's not laying good to do anything with it. That's what I'm saying. That ball's going to stay there for a minute. And yeah, Jason's in a little trouble here. He might take a slow kick at it kick behind it and just move it three, four inches towards him, but that can get away from you. And a lot of times that's, you at least yep. sell out a twist back. That's bang. right. you got to hit this real soft just like that. Nice touch. Oh, boy, what a good yep. hit that was. Did yep. that sell out a twist back, back? That's right. Now he'll go rail first with left and knock this up by his side pocket. Good shot. Yeah, Jason, uh, Justin has wiggled out of... Uh, Having all the balls on Jason's side, he's got a chance to win the game. Now just drive something to your side, put the cue ball down by Jaybird, just like that. Freeze it. He likes to freeze it on the rail. It limits what you can do. <laughs> mm -hmm. We got two killers here. These guys know the game. Back in the 90s, when I was first learning one pocket, 
like Cliff Joyner really knew the game and Scott Frost, but now there's there's just 15 or 20 guys that move like that. You know, yeah. I attribute some of that to YouTube and AccuStats and and you and Jeremy Jones and the great comment Josh Roberts and you know people can really learn a lot. I learned from AccuStats and um, no better way than to watch these great players. I can't say enough good things about Josh Roberts. Uh, oh. One pocket commentary. Oh, he's fantastic. I and mean, he plays like these guys. Look at this shot. And he got a little fortunate there. He wasn't trying to do that. He even tapped the table saying, pardon me. Just keep the cue ball possibly right there, real soft. Nice touch. Jay Bird will do the same thing, I would venture to guess. Yeah, they're chatting. This is why this game would have a hard time on ESPN. Most people would watch this part of the game and go, what in yeah, the world? Yeah. My uncle could rob these two. <laughs> <laughs> My uncle. He didn't even make a ball there. Mm -hmm. This is a tough situation for Jason. He, he uh, I mean, you can just sell out a million different ways here. I kind of like him doing something with the eight. Real light, just brushing it to the end rail like that. There you go. Cover all the lanes. When you get in a spot like that, don't do anything too exotic. Just uh, mm -hmm. be simple. Hmm. Well, he's looking at the bank on the nine. He'd have to hit it. Well, he, well, I'll tell you what. As good as he banks, he might stun the cue ball forward underneath the 12. What a shot. Just dead. Beautiful. Side. Just dead. Side. Beautiful shot. Absolutely. Yeah, you got to play some kind of safety here. I don't think you can, don't think you can shoot at this. I mean, you could double bank the six, then bank the 12, but I like him just knocking something to his side. Looks like if he tried to double bank the six, it's right. going to come off right. close to the five. That's right. Yeah, he smartly turned that down. He didn't go with the John Schmidt crackhead bank. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jaybird's well on his way to making this hill hill. He's uh, he's turned things around. It looked like he had no chance there in the beginning. Ball counts 2-2, two, two, but they favor Justin. They favor Justin pretty good. What? Now, what in the world? Surely he's not banking at the seven ball. Oh my God! I can't. I can't believe how good he just hit that. Look at this shot. Man, that was gutsy. You sell out the two there if you don't hit that perfect, and then the, usually the seven also will go down there and leave the bank. Yeah, right. Man, you that missed. was that was gutsy. There's no way around it. Just get this anywhere near your hole. Get the cue ball safe. Good shot. <coughs> Wow. Now, this is interesting. I really I don't quite see what he's looking at here. Hmm. I have no idea what he's doing right here, Mark. Is he crossing it? I mean... He can't cross it to his hole. I mean, you could do that, but you sell it. Well, I'll tell you what. That came a lot closer than I thought it could. Nice shot. Now he's testing Bird. Bird has to make a nice shot on uh, Donald Trump here. If he misses this, he blows the game. If he makes it, he's going to get one. This is a lot of pressure to get one ball. But, but my goodness, the pressure I mean, balls he made were way well, tougher than this. Yeah, I mean, this is. <laughs> there's a scratch there's, possibility, There's a scratch, too, too in the side, yeah. got to hold your head still and make this ball. Look at this. Look at this. What a shot. That was missable. Nice shot there. Well, he's got a 4-2 lead. Yeah, 
but Jason's playing great. I mean, he made that bank. If he missed that bank, it would have mm -hmm. been uh, got away from him a little bit. Well, this is the first maybe moving error this game. Like we were talking about at the international, that's that's a, a Joe Biden shot. You got an unwanted kiss. <laughs> Oh, oh, he didn't. Oh, oh, he just caught it a little His bridge hand come apart. Almost and, came up. After yeah. all the great shots yep, he made, yep, the yep, one yep. that I would have bet that he makes yep. that and get positioned. Yeah, I got to make that one. Do you um, see how he didn't even come close he, to getting he, uh, uh, position? Yeah. His bridge hand came apart. Yeah, he needed a he hold lifted. steady there. Yeah, he didn't he did. like it. Well, I'll tell you what. Justin has to make a great shot here. But if he does. Oh, if he does. It's, uh, I think Justin's going to bet the game on this he, and go over for the two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Two that, of the eight. If he makes this, that that shot could cost Jay Bird the match. Nice. Oh, I thought he made it. Well, in case you think pool's an easy game, I mean, here's two world-class players, you know. You can miss anything. Well, he was making sure he got the mm -hmm. cue ball over there. Try, but I'm surprised. I would have thought that Justin would have bet the game and just stay for the two. J just Jason. Oh, this. Justin. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Stay the mm -hmm. simplest, you know, just get the two. Now, now this would be a cool-looking shot. He's going to try to cut the eight in and let the cue ball. Mm -hmm. I think that's what he can do. It's pretty free. It He's looks free enough, as free as it's going to get. And you got a little helper over there. Yeah. A little something maybe going yeah, on. That's right. Yeah, Listen I, to me. I'm talking I, like one pocket guy. I, oh, well, you, well, you know how to play one pocket. <laughs> yeah, don't be... Acting like you don't as you uh, assassinated me at your house last time we played. Uh-huh. Yeah, it was one out of seven. Well, whatever. Cents. It wins a win. Yeah. You're only as good as your last performance. That's right. If he can cut the eight towards his hole, that's the shot. And let the cue ball go two rails out to the middle. I mean, I'm shooting this. I'm just going to nick it over there, even if you got to play it off the ten. I think he's afraid of the kiss. The cue ball is going to chase this mm -hmm. and maybe kiss it off the end rail, but yeah. I don't see what else you can do. Left English will help you beat the kiss. Oh, he hit it pretty decent. All right. Hmm. <laughs> wow. Comes charging. Yeah, up just, there. just. I might just run out on you. Uh huh. Man, I'll tell you, you got to make the two to just really Ooh. do nothing. I would have to play a safety. Uh, yeah. I would think so, too. Well, <laughs> I have a tendency to chicken out in spots like this, but I don't know. I don't like shooting at shots where I can get one unless he thinks he can draw into those balls some kind of way. I mean, yeah, that was asking a lot there, kind of, I mean, to get one. All right, Bird, you got a chance to tie this match up hill, hill. He's playing for four. I see two right away. Well, what I'd do here is I might try to make the two off this ten right now. I would have just came straight across, tried to make the two. Um, yeah, make the eight, then give him the two. Don't try to get on the 14. You might paint yourself into a corner where you can't see the two. Right, Mark? If yes, you try to get on the 14, you can trap yourself on the two, you think? He's trying to open up everything. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. He's okay. Took a little chance. Yeah, just give him this. Yeah, he settled in. He's he's playing great. Pretty nice attempt Nine, sure. there. Heck yeah. Suppose that Justin could have made the one ball with that shot too simultaneously. Yeah, that's right. that's keeps right. a lot of pressure on. What do we got here? You see what he tried to do there? He was trying to nudge the 13, 15 because they're dead. Yeah. So he was trying to move those. They always are trying to do maximum damage, damage when they come to the table. Okay. I'm glad I'm not the only one that does that sometimes. Now, he might. Well, he's going to move the 13. I know that. He's got to untie these. <laughs> you know what he's wanting to do? I think he's wanting to, like, triple bank this to his hole. Boom, 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 or something. Mm -hmm. He's looking at it kind of. Oh. 
optimistically. I don't know. I wouldn't do anything fancy here. You're leading in the game. But he's winding up, but he's doing no, something. No, that's here. what I like. Well, yeah, that could not have worked out any worse. I think back cut to 13. The cue ball goes into the ball, That's the 12 right. ball, I right? I think so. I think it could. But it can do a lot of bad stuff doing that. But, yeah, yeah it, it it for sure can. But you're not going to play it reckless. No. I mean, yes, bad things can happen, but also something good yeah. can happen from here. Justin needs to bury this bank if he can, or at least get it hanging. He might even get into the six ball. No, no, he hit it perfect. Carried the 12 and everything. What a shot. Yeah. That Again, that was maximum damage right there. He took a ball away from Bird's side, put Bird on the end rail, put one by his hole. I mean, you couldn't want anything more out of a shot. It's always good to see what elite players do mm -hmm. from sticky situations right. like this. Oh, I... I I was lucky in that I used to get to set and watch like Gabe Owen and Jeremy Jones and Cliff Joyner, guys like that play for days on end, and um, I picked up quite a bit of help watching those great players. And plus you uh, lost your life savings three times to yes. Jack Cooney, right? that's right. And that really helped. Yep. <laughs> well, Gave you the nice shooting, Jack. Hey, I'm the CEO <laughs> of my own minimum wage empire, okay? So, <laughs> I mean, oh, look at this. Oh, okay, I thought he was going for the cut. Yeah, Jack Cooney, I learned a lot watching him. Played him 100 hours worth, and he moved like these guys. He knew every shot in the book. and Broke uh, your heart more than oh, once. Oh, yeah, I think I broke two cues playing him, lost my all my money. L learned, uh, like, going to college. We pretty much. Really? Well, I remember my dad just telling me one day, he's like, well, there's 400 million people in America. Couldn't you just play somebody else? I'm like, <laughs> it doesn't work like that, Dad. I've got to try to beat this guy. <laughs> I'd come home. And say, How'd you do? I lost six thousand. Well, well, can't you play somebody else? You know. <laughs> nice shot there. Yeah, we're getting to see some one pocket now. This is this is uh, the middle and the end game takes takes so long to really understand how to play and I still haven't mastered it but I mean I, I just have got to see it so much that it's starting to make more sense to me because if you don't uh, move good at the end of the game you have no chance I don't think I ever beat Cliff Joyner one game when we both needed one ball in like a three year period that's how good he moved show hand down there uh, putting on a clinic Playing Skylar Woodward. What a match. Yeah, getting the little Varner wedge working here. Now, this is what Jaybird wants. He's up six balls to three, so he'd be fine with them all being up here and then playing bank pool one ball at a time. Knowing him, he might he might three rail the thirteen or something. Okay, no, no, he was getting wound up like he was going to do <laughs> something froggy. Good shot. That's what I like right there. You leave a player this far away from the balls, and it limits what they can do, of course. And it makes them susceptible That's to right. an error. That's right. Same thing. Create distance here. Separation and distance. Not to be hypercritical, mm -hmm. but the cue ball wasn't right. You know, it, yeah. it should be on the end because yeah. then you really start putting heat oh, on it where yeah. he's got to concentrate. Oh, oh, looky here. That will not Earned an opening. Uh -huh. At his level, too, Bird, that's, that's sickening for him to do that because he, you know, he just knows, like, to not do that he just got but you know he's a rhythm player he's a money player so they, they they don't even sit down in their chair they just stand there and shoot 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 but you know what i mean with mm -hmm. justin he needed to work the cue ball down That's, there deeper 
Well, I'll tell you what, the way these balls are laying, I mean, he might go two rails and end up straight in on the 14 and run three or four balls on here. Got to make a good shot here, of course. Spun it with some inside. That was a very good shot to make more, that with More than just some. Yeah. <laughs> he yeah, loaded he that, loaded that up. up. That, that, was, that was a heck of a shot. Yeah, that was an unnatural path right. to get there. Right. Yeah, to the uninformed, it was like, that wasn't a hard shot. He used two full tips of side spin. Tons of squirt. Mm -hmm. Wood shaft. Yeah. Borrowed cue. <laughs> yeah, right. While texting. Yeah, while beer in hand from the bar that sponsors him. <laughs> now, he's going to try to get on the six here, isn't he? I don't no, know. No, it looks scratch. too thin. Exactly. It looks too thin to me. Don't yeah. Do that. Yeah, he'll just bank the two railer. Oh, now, now he can get on the six. Watch this. This will be cool looking. He's going to snuggle that cue ball right behind the six here. Look at Justin. He, he, just, like, oh, 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 yeah. he just feels this. Oh, he yeah. just feels like I'm going to pin this guy down right here. Get that ball close to my pocket. Perfect. Did he let him see it? I no, think he so. didn't quite. No, wasn't I think able he, to hold it. Boy, birds out of the disaster. Got him out is of the treetop yes, there. Yes, but he is treetopped. So the score is now 6-5, Jason. Oh, nice shot. Man, he could have butchered that. Treetop like that, spinning his ball with left. Uh, Justin would love to two-rail that down there and get the cue ball across, but I don't think it lays No, it right. isn't quite laying right yeah. now. He just, oh, look at here. Taking the subway? No. Whew. Yikes, that had his full attention. Oh, God, he scratched. No, okay. That would have been kind of unfortunate to scratch up mm -hmm. there. This isn't that rail no, first shot. No, it, no, no the point, quite. the side pocket's in the way. Well, I'll tell you what, he might have sold out a bank here. All right, Jason. This is as good. Now nope, it froze up on him. I don't know if he can beat the kiss. Well, maybe this is that rail first mm. shot. Yeah, I really. think he's banking it with some insiding. That's trying to just turn it downhill. Nope. Oh, don't scratch off the balls. Oof. <laughs> All right. Bank the 14. Stay behind the 15. Oh, he's gonna lay. He's gonna go into the 15. Perfect. Yeah, that bank's so nice. Even when they miss, it looks like it's going in. Can you dig this out, Marcus, with rail first? Oh, that's definitely dangerous. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Very I don't know. dangerous shot. I don't know if he can get this out. You have to do this with some inside English. Oh, oh. Ooh. Oh, it hung up. Well, that was... Um, yeah. That would that was help, helpful there. That will give your backer her yeah. palpitations. Yeah. Good job there. Get that way up there where it's not bankable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's got a thread on his side with the 14. Here we go. Here's that look, Schmitty, right there. Oh, yeah, he Yeah, made a nice shot and really uh, dodged a bullet there, not scratching. He's right in the thick of it now. If he scratches there, probably been over. Nice Trying shot. to take away the Look straight right. back. Yeah. I like the angle he put him on. Problem banking this ball is your cue ball runs out on you. Just hard to hold it. See, and now this ball will jump up for a bank almost every time. So hard to hit that good. This isn't easy. No, this isn't easy because you have to hit it so thin on the new cloth to get it near your hole that your cue ball runs wild. I don't think you should even try to bank it. Yeah, exactly. Smart call. You're right. That wasn't even close. Now, hmm. Once again, trying to get him too stiff on the... 15 ball, so he has to play the 14. Well, he's hitting this 15 with some inside English. Well, he's he? going that way. Wow, he's this can go it. so bad. This can go so bad. I mean, <sighs> that shot there, I mean, your cue ball has to roll exactly perfectly straight. Now, I don't know about you. I like just cinching this and making sure I make it. 
try to just, you know, don't, don't. Well, do you get shape on the 15 no, here? Uh, just no, just make yeah, sure just you get make, that ball yeah, down. You're on the hill now. Now, right. whatever, you play ball for ball. That's right. Everything's yeah. out of play. I think he goes here. He's going to shoot yeah. this bank. He'll go around the 15 with some right English. Beautiful. Drano. How smooth did he oh. hit it? Oh, he just caught it a little heavy. You see, this is where a guy like Justin is so dangerous, needing three, and he'll just get them from nowhere. He'll whip in a couple banks, and, mm -hmm. you know, you just, you just can't believe you're going to lose the game. Jason going for his pocket um, on 15. I think so, yeah, with a high right ball. Okay, good touch. Didn't leave a bank. Yeah, that was a nice shot. Spin this out of there. Knock it up by your side. Good shot. Well, Jason could bank this. I think he could bank this one, too. Tough bank, of course, but he's going to shoot it. I would think. Yeah, yeah, it was. Oh, he hit it pretty decent. Overcut it just a touch. Mm. I'm happy hitting it like that from there. I mean, just getting it anywhere near your hole is a good shot. Same shot Good each shot. time. Good shot. Yeah. Made sure not to miss it to the long rail to where there's a bank. <laughs> Look at that quality effort. I mean, you think? Look at the cue ball. Yeah, just such a My nice goodness. shot. My goodness. Such a nice shot. Jail. Now, this here, I like him just driving the 15 out, but this can, man, you can scratch here. You can double kiss this. This is, uh, this is a nightmare, this shot. I might kick to the end rail here and kick it up. I wouldn't go ball first here. Oh, man, he's going ball first. I've messed this up so many times. No, I like this better. Yeah, good shot. Even if you sell out right, one bank, yeah, right? Yeah, it's better than blowing the whole game, scratching. Now, can Justin three rail that 14? So I, if that, anybody huh? could, it's this guy. But he, he's got to let the cue ball kind of go forward so he doesn't leave a cut on the 15, right? Right, right. And then if you go forward, that makes the 15 bigger to help right. block the 14. Yeah. It would be interesting to now, see. Now, this is not the guy you want shooting a three railer on you. Beauty. Perfect speed. <laughs> Didn't go in, but it looks like it's gonna every time. And Bird started getting trouble. Luckily, the six is out of play. He's happy about that. Kick this ball up. Do oh no. Oh. Jeez. Now, Justin has to make a nice shot. Cut this and go twice. Miss the side pocket, or sling it. Side rail, end rail, side rail for shape. You have to hit this with high speed to do this. Oh, that's that's the that's trouble. That that shot is hard to do. Well, he was trying a lot to of get deflection six, and yeah. a lot of deflection and yeah, and trying to make the six. What do you do here, Mark? Pump it in or roll it? I'm rolling it like a big old coward. <sighs> big old coward. Shooting at one mile an hour. Oh. I'm shooting at one mile an hour, I'm telling you. No pause. No pause no, that, at all. He no. completely broke down technique-wise. Yeah. After yeah. all those tough ones he pumped in. Yeah. I thought we were going to see another one from downtown Brown. Yeah. They, I mean, that was a tough shot, but I would have liked to have seen him, you know, slow that backswing down a little bit more. Well, it's nothing I haven't done. It's pressure out there. Mm -hmm. I've seen the best golfers in the world, like, miss two footers. I mean, the pressure can bust a pipe. Oh, wow. He hit that pretty good. 
thought he made it. <laughs> Is he kicking two rails and playing shape so. on the 15? Oh, my God. What a shot. Man, that was gutsy. Well, there's definitely a, but see, the ball count is why he shot it like that. That was actually yeah. the right shot with the ball count. More times than not, he's going to nick that ball over to his hole, and your cue ball is going to be up here on the six. Now, it's tough to hit it too thin. I'll tell you what, I'd move the cue ball out to the middle of the table and just nick this one over to the hole real soft. Just hit it soft. You, now, look, he sold out the whole game doing that. I just don't think you're supposed to shoot those hard. He's got to go to the John Schmidt School of Cowardice. <laughs> I'm, I would just, I would have put the cue ball way out in the middle and just grazed the one over near my hole. If he loses this game from that, he'll, I don't know. Justin's got to just drift over, get yeah, under 14, I mean, come know, back I'll down, you, 15, he, then he, bank the six. Well, he's pretty flat on this ball. He has to pop this with a well, nice. He's got ball in hand. Oh yeah, he does. Why is he putting it so flat? No, no, I don't. No, I don't think he's got ball in hand. Well, didn't he just? Scratch? No, no, he just missed. No, he didn't have ball in hand. Oh, he no, just he would missed. have set it up with more my angle. Bad. Yeah, my bad. Yeah, that's right. But that's I'll tell you what, he's got a chance to win the game. Well, I'm pulling for Justin too, but I'd like to see this go hill. No, hill. me I too. I love hill hills yeah. unless I'm in them. <laughs> nice shot. No, big favorite now. Filtering. He's a big favorite. Kind of a nice angle uh -huh. to get the bank shape on the six. Yep. Man, Jason made some of the hardest shots in this set, too. But You know, this is interesting. I think Justin would like to have position to yeah. cross the six yeah, and leave the wrong cue with ball that. Yeah. That level rather than play the uh -huh. more traditional bank. Yeah, he could hit this shot with high riding instead of left, but he went with the left now. And yeah, this is going to get it close. Yeah, now smart. he can control the cue ball good this yeah. way, too. Yeah. So now that he got that close. Yeah. yeah, he's a giant favorite. He's up two games and one and shooting this bank. So um, Jace, Jason has to dodge a major bullet here to survive. Huge shot here. Match ball. Oh, he, he hit it a little all. heavy, just a little heavy, and he might sell out a bank. Oh, man, Jason's got to be thinking, oh, my God, I can't believe I might win this game. No, it's, he was dead. Looks in the like water. it's froze up on the rail. I think John. it is, Marcus. I think it's brutal. There's a little gap, but I don't even know if he's shooting it. it might just be dry. He looks like he's cueing it. Oh, well, how about that? What I mean, a how shot. you like coming with that? What a shot. Unreal. <laughs> all right, 2 2. Jaybird. <laughs> Jaybird smiling. Laughing, jiving, high-fiving. Well, here's the thing. I don't think Jason Brown's played up to his ability in spots, and he's hill-hill. Now, Justin's breaking, though. Well, he's definitely made some oh. fine shots. Oh, he's made three of the hardest shots in this match. Oh, my God. But, um, yeah, I was, you know, I liked it. I learned that from Cooney. A spot shot, you just put the cue ball way out in the middle, real thin and just nick the ball over i mean the worst you're going to do is miss it it stays an inch from your hole mm -hmm. but when you shoot it like he did and it doesn't go in it overcuts and sells mm -hmm. out i don't know yeah i like i like doing the little layaway with, program with the, the layaway program there's yeah. four balls on the table and you leave nothing when you miss exactly you might make it now if it's if it's like you both need well no i'd still do it if you both need one maybe maybe not i might you know but in that scenario with the ball count just graze it over there no reason to take a chance of losing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're going to have a short time out here, Schmitty. Yeah. All right. Well, now winning the lag proves to be a of great value. You know, the thing is, though, with this table, the way it breaks, just because you're breaking, I mean, you can sell out that corner ball, and they run eight and out on you. you got to be careful. It, it, with, with Alex, I broke him what I thought was good, and that ball shot out of there. Yeah. You know, on this new cloth, I think maybe you move the cue ball more to the center and put less impact on the rack. You see a lot of guys do right, it. Right, right. Yeah, you see a lot of guys do it. Here's Jay See, because that's normally where I break from, but I might even move the cue ball to his left two inches. He laid down a good break his first ones. No, oh, he didn't solve that corner ball at all. I and oh, man, big trouble real right good, off the bat. Real good break, Jay Hall. <laughs> Look at it. He's... Man. Fist bumping a fan. Oh, no. Got a bottle of water. Jay Hall's <laughs> drinking water? What the heck? <laughs> now, what is he doing? He's cutting at this. Oh, he's cutting at this. Oh, he missed it. 
He was no, good. he was just he oh. was just throttling it over oh. there. So. Oh, oh, yeah, he wasn't going for the cut. Okay, right. just nicking it over there. Uh, Jay Hill might play that one box. No, well, he's going he to get through there or behind just get it. behind it. Oh, just wow. get he behind can fit it. right between there. Oh, what a shot. And he wanted the soft speed, what kept a little a double shot. kiss. Now he's got everything protected. Uh-huh. That was powerful there. It neutralized. First off, Jason made a great shot, and then Justin made a great shot. And yeah. Jason shook his head side to side like, oh, oh man, he's he put me in a bad spot here. Now, now this shot has always spooked me. Oh. I, I'm just terrified. Of it. Well, just I On, just can't figure out where to aim. He, hit it, he hit it perfect. Well, maybe not perfect. Oh, no, he didn't hit it perfect. I thought he hit that just right. That's what I usually do right there. I sell out there. I hate that shot. And the worst part, a foul. You know, not only did you saw, yeah, but you also yeah, you one. one. He's straight in. It's brutal. But it was the right shot. It's just that executing it is just creepy on new cloth to try to figure out where to aim. Well, you could have gone two rails. Right? Yeah, Three. something. I mean, I mean, at this point, you'd wish you'd have done anything but that. Oh, oh boy. got perfect. Got right through. Might there. even be able to chew into the stack a little here you as he draw draws back. back. For the three. Yep. Absolutely. Yep. Now, don't go for a home run. No. This is chip. This is just a wiggle them free. Just wiggle. Just going to get two free. Oh, oh Josh. That's about the worst thing. Through. Worst thing you could do right you there. You got to pull it back off the. Uh, now, he's got to nick this in somehow, jacked up, and try to get on the one. Or on the two. If you sell out the 12. Well, okay, good shot. Very good oh, shot. Did, man. Boy, he couldn't hit that any better. He's got a chance to uh, get over there for the two. Make a good shot here, obviously. This is uh, frozen. Definitely missable. Oh, good shot. He did. Oh, yeah, he look at just got that. Yeah, oh, nice. Now, do you like making this and then <laughs> yes. banking the 12? Yeah, I like to play shape to stick the cue ball right on the side mm -hmm. of the stack there and bank the 12 nah, back from my right. pocket. That's right. Keep the heat on my man. I don't like to go into him here. Boy, he looks like he's winding he up. He does. He's wow, doing, what a shot. Something far more aggressive, uh -huh. something far better than. Uh -huh. Yeah, <laughs> he, he uh, I'll tell you, man, you can miss that ball hit with that side spin frozen off the rail. That was a heck of a shot. I don't know if the five ball clears, but he's looking like a combination. Look at, he's right on the combination, and he knows he can oh, win yeah, with this. this. If he makes it, up. he can win the yeah, match. This opens him right up. He did make it, and now he's got a multitude of choices. Yeah, these top players are tough to beat on their break. It is really hard Playing to Playing for two. Oh. oh, what happened? Something spooked him here. Changed his mind. Is he going for the nine next, right? Six and then the nine? Um, yeah, I think the nine next. That's short travel. He might even go into the 11 here. No. no. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's good. Isn't he? I think so. Yeah, I think he is. He needs what, uh, two, three? One. Oh, no, one. He needs yeah. one, yeah. Double checking. Yeah. yeah, I like these shots right here to win a match. I'm pretty good at these. Uh, Ken Schumann's out here now, counting. Didn't make anything elsewhere. No, I don't think. I don't yeah, think, I think Jason this is just. This is it. Yeah. Well, things are winding down here. It looks like Justin's going to win this match. It was a, a real honor to work with you, Mark. Yeah. What is going on here? I have no idea. He's conceding the oh, shot. Oh, okay. I was going to say. Uh, okay. <laughs> that was an unusual conclusion, mm -hmm. but a yeah. great run out by Justin Hall. Yeah, two super talented players. A lot of fun to, to get a chance to watch this and work with you, Mark. Thanks and, for having me. Oh, we're glad to have you. And we did get to see some of the Jason Brown one-pocket yes. excellence. That was good because it looked like it was going to be a, like a blitzkrieg mm -hmm. there to That's begin good. with. So. Yep. All right, this has been an AccuStats video production. Any rebroadcast or republication without AccuStats written permission is expressly prohibited. That is our time for this time. Until next time, so long.